Get the brand new Sir Meowth onesie, now available at DennisDaily.com. I got an idea. When was the last time you hopped on a jailbreak and you thought that you finally discovered something that nobody was gonna think of? Huh? When was the last time you were confident enough to be able to say, Wow, I think I'm on to something. Well, let me tell you something, guys. Usually, whenever you want to break out of prison, you try to find a police officer because you want to steal from them. Or avoid them, one of the two. But, did you ever think about stealing from other prisoners? Doors open, oh my goodness. Wow. Wow. Okay, hold on. I'll get back to my thought in just a second. I just want this shotgun. I want the pistol real quick. Oh, actually, I'll take this gun too. Why not? Even though, actually, no, I'm pretty sure the pistol is the best one in the game. Okay, but anyways, I don't have a key card, but this guy has a key card. We know that. So all we have to do is follow the penguin man, and then whenever he dies... He'll, he'll drop his key card, wouldn't he? he drop his key card, and then we can just take that. And you see? And then the, the cops aren't ever really looking out for that one. But I'm not entirely too sure. I hope this will work out. <laughs> Hopefully. Otherwise, though, then I'm going on a mission that is uh, doomed to fail. But here we go. You know, you're never going to find out if something works until you try. And uh, this guy here, he's well, he's acting, he's typing while operating a helicopter. That can't be safe. Um, I'm probably gonna parachute out. Uh, I'll get out when he gets out, because he obviously knows what he's doing. Wait a second. This is is that was that the po? Is that the po? Is that that that's the po? That's the po? No, no. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll get the po in just a second. Huh? Oh. Ow! No! Get him! Uh. Uh. Yes! Oh! Oh! Good work! Now, wow, I was really close to dying there. Oh my goodness. Okay, so now, if this guy dies, <laughs> I'm not gonna betray him. Uh, you know, we're both on the same team. I'm just saying, if he dies... There was a police officer over there. Oh my goodness. Hold on, come on, come on. Look around the corner, I dare you. Oh no, I need to reload. Okay, hold on. Gonna look around the corner. We're gonna get him. But if this penguin man, if he dies, you know, it's like, why wouldn't I just like real quick, uh, oh! Did he drop it? Did he drop a key card? Hey, eh, stop that, Mr. Policeman. Oh, he's dead. Okay, did he not drop a, no. Okay, I gotta get out of here. No, how am I supposed to, oh! Okay, hold on, I might not actually be able to make it. Maybe I should go back. Let myself heal. Oh, <laughs> so little health. Oh no, this is bad. This is really, really bad. Man, why didn't he drop a key card? That was my whole plan. <laughs> Come on. That's how you get the key card. Unless prisoners don't drop key cards. That might just be a thing. You guys can let me know in the comments though. Hey, oh, no, 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 you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Eh. Yes, yes. Very good. Very good. Okay. Oh no, here comes another guy. No, no, no. No. Arrested. <laughs> I ran out of ammo! Okay. And I had very little health, so I was really, really slow. We're gonna try that again. Uh, you guys always say that there could potentially be key cards in here. Does that mean that you put the key card in there? Like, prisoners can grab a key card, go hide it in a cell, and then you just go grab it later? Or can they just spawn in there? If there's, like, a very slight chance of them spawning in there, that'd be sweet. But I don't know that. I was really, really heavily relying on the idea that maybe, just maybe, prisoners could drop key cards. <laughs> kind of foils my entire plan. Um, let's maybe see if, uh, oh, there's this guy again. You know, he did pretty good. I mean, we both failed the, the heist, but it's okay. I mean, we had a lot of police officers coming at us at once. <sighs> Okay, anyways though, uh, let's see, has the bounty gone up at all since we last checked? 550 bounty? Okay, this person's actually getting somewhere, so we got a little bit of catching up to do. That's fine, I don't mind. Oh, police officer standing completely still. Please be AFK. No, he's not. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's fine. You know what else could technically be considered stealing from other prisoners is if they were to kill a police officer, but then I just ran and picked up the key card, that actually works too. You know, because then it's technically theirs that they're, uh, 
that the the, the the key card that they're going for. Okay, can I just like real quick? I just want to stop punching me. Who's punching me right now? Hmm? I'm just trying to steal a key card. Uh, this is not this is not working well at all. It's not even popping up. It's not prompting me to to steal anything. Okay, no, I don't know if that actually works or not. I guess we could just open this. That works too. Go, go. Okay, we'll have to steal a key card from somebody else a little bit later. Uh, okay, so we lift this. Please don't taste me. No. Uh. <laughs> yes! And he's now stuck. He needs to lift the gate again. That's <laughs> amazing. Okay. Go, 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 go. Uh, that's a police car. I'm not even sure if I can get in. Can I get in this one, please? Okay, go backwards, please. Oh my goodness. Yes, yes. And we just back out of there. No. Come on, here we go. Mobile garage. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. No, he got rid of the tires. The tires are back. The tires came back at the worst possible time. Well, great. Now this guy's running for me. Two people run out of the car. That guy was behind me, and he still decides to go for me. Are you kidding me? That other guy would have been so much easier to get. He ended up getting both of us, though. That's pretty impressive. Oh, unless the other guy... Actually, no, I think the other guy reset character because he shot me down. Also, what's the point in arresting someone and then killing them? That's just, like, overkill. A little bit much. A little bit much, guys, all right? We can, we can calm it down. It's all right, okay? I got caught. I get it. Excuse me. Excuse me, Penguin Fair. I am trying to catch up with this guy who is still at 550 bounty. So he's not really making too much progress, actually. You know, he's kind of staying in the same little spot. I suppose I can come out of this way. Don't mind if I do. Just a little bit of an explosion. Okay, in three, two, one. <laughs> And we're off. <laughs> I love this new run I have. <laughs> it's amazing. The elderly animation pack is probably my favorite one on Roblox. It's hilarious. Uh, it's just, I don't know. It, it's very well animated. Very well done. No, oh, there's a guy right there. No. And that dude's doing the penguin thing. I probably should be doing that too. Would definitely help. But that's okay. No matter. Here we go. And I get into this car. Thank you, sir. Yes. So he even- No! I just got tased! No! I was right there! That's okay. Oh, oh, wait. I was broken out of the handcuffs. I was broken out of the handcuffs! I didn't know that. I was too busy- I was too busy being sad about everything that just happened. Oh, come on. Oh, I wish I was paying more attention. Okay. I gotta wait another 10 seconds. I swear half this video is gonna be waiting to just exit the prison cell. Oh, don't worry, don't worry. Everything's gonna be fine. Just need a couple more seconds here. And sprint. Let's go. Okay, bounty's changed now. Top bounty to beat is 250. Very doable. Um, it's just it, the, the only small problem with that is we can't seem to just leave the prison. Could come out this way. Suppose I could. Yes. Okay. Wow. There's a lot of prisoners, actually. Okay, come on. Why wasn't it exploding? Three. No, sorry. Four. Three. Two. One. Okay. Sweet. Now that we're out and that probably every single police officer is going to be on us. Uh, oh, there's one out there, actually. So he's probably going to. No, he's not coming out for us. Interesting. I'm just gonna run to a- uh, actually, I'm not gonna run to that car because there's a police officer there. That police officer looks AFK though. Is he AFK? I don't know. I have no idea. Pickpocket? No way. No way. No way. Go. 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 Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come, come, come. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. We gotta go, we gotta go. Okay, let's go. Yes. Can we honk? <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Sweet. Okay, so now me and this other this this other dude, who were, were you know we we tried robbing the bank earlier. We were so close, but now this time, we both have key cards. We're gonna work together. I'm not gonna be thinking about betraying him. <laughs> well, it's not that it's not that I was gonna betray him. I was just gonna use him. You know. Because I thought I could get a key card out of it. Okay, hold on. Is that that's a police officer? We don't want. No, dude. Why did you jump out? Why did you jump out? No, get back in. Get back in. Go. <laughs> what were you thinking? Okay. Um. 
Let's back up into here. There we go. Okay. Good job, Dennis. Why, thank you, Kevin. Thank you very much. Okay, hold on. I need to be better at driving. Here. Can we rob? Oh, can we? I think we can. No, we just missed it. No. I am sick and tired of missing the jewelry store heist. I'm always there literally like one second too late. It is so frustrating. I can't remember the last time I did the jewelry store heist just because of that. Because of just how unbelievably, extremely, frustratingly small the time period is to get into the store. <sighs> okay, well, let's try the bank then in that case. Unbelievable. I don't think I'm ever gonna make it into the, the stupid jewelry store. Okay, I need to go. I need to get a gun. Can't even kill that police officer over there. We need to go over here, this little hideout. Okay, so I'm just gonna like grab this real quick. Change out of my stuff. Change out of this. And then equip some of this, some of that, you know? Mm. What? Why am I naked? What? Ew! Oh, no. <laughs> okay, well, this is weird and gross, and I don't like it, but you know what? That's what Jailbreak did. It wasn't our choice. Um, I'm just going to roll with it, honestly. <laughs> Let me do another sick drift right here. Oh, a little bit of a rollover. That's okay. Don't mind. Come in like this. We have to wait so long for this jewelry store now. Okay, here we go. Those were two police officers there. That's another one right there. Nope, bad, 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 bad. Jump, jump. Okay. Oh, no, you don't. No! What? How? Are you kidding me? He wasn't even holding anything, and he was so far away for it. Taze. And then he kills me. Great, awesome. This game, man, it feels so unbelievably not balanced. I might be wrong, but like, I don't know, literally every single time I play this game, I can't just help but like face palm at how like unbelievably OP the, the, the police feel. It's insane. It's like they can essentially just one shot you. If the police officer is like competent at all, it's impossible to do anything about them because they, they just have these insane tools to work with. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. <sighs> But it should not be this difficult. Here, look, look, look. I'm gonna pretend like, you know, I'm trying to explode this, right? Right, right? Just like this, you know? See? They're like, okay, okay, yeah, he's trying to explode, right? But then, you see? They're like waiting to arrest. And then. Pickpocket, 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 pickpocket. Why did it stop pickpocketing? No! Okay, you, here. Let me just do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Please. <laughs> <sighs> Dennis, take the card, please. Can I? Please. I would love to. Thank you. Thank you. I'm sick and tired of having to do this over and over again. I just want to be able to rob things normally and not have to all of a sudden wait all over again for the jewelry store because someone else happens to get into it seconds before I do literally every single time. Uh, and then I'm sick and tired of having these good runs, but then uh, it can all get ended by the police officer clicking one button because then they're given a taser that works with one shot, and then they can just arrest you. And even if you shoot them ten times in the face, doesn't matter. Uh, what's this guy doing? Is this police officer gonna rob a bank with me? Is that what? <laughs> is that what's happening? Oh, okay. Wow. Uh, excuse me. I didn't think so. Oh, no, this is bad. Okay, you know what? No, 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 no. And now he's shooting at me. No, sir, I do not want it. Please. It's okay, sir, I don't want your help. I don't want your help. I want to take care of this guy. All How? How? How does he catch up to me to get close? I'm uh, in a full sprint. And this guy can just walk up to me and arrest me just like that. It doesn't make any sense. This game is 
Okay, snowman, look, I need to get out of my cell, okay? Every time I'm arrested, I need to do the exact same thing over and over. I would like to be able to do this successfully and then not just get punished for playing the game normally. Reward the players that are actually doing what they're supposed to be doing normally and, and, and not just making it impossible to do anything. How about that? Huh? I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know what my opinion is on it anymore because on one hand, it's really hard to get a high bounty, which is a good thing because then it's like an actual challenge. But on the other hand, it feels like there's such a... There, there's, there's no real, really like well-defined skill gap because it, like everyone's just going to kind of... It doesn't matter if one person is like better or faster than the other like makes but just like has better decision making It just gets all shut down by things that like level it out too much There's no there's no separation in in player skill and also the snowman on my car isn't allowing me to drive normally Thank you very much, dude. Here we go. I need to drive away from him And then I can swerve away so that we avoid him <sighs> what do we do? What do we do? What do we want to do? I need to go get a gun. I'm sick and tired of not having a gun, and then I just need to run away, but it doesn't matter because they're going to take me down with John anyways. It doesn't even matter. Actually, even if I do get a gun, it doesn't matter because I can in unload my entire clip into them, and it doesn't do anything because this game isn't balanced at all. It's not even a little bit. There you go. There. How about that? Huh? Hmm? There you go. So, change out of this, put on this and that. Okay, I'm not naked this time either, which is sweet. What is this shotgun? Is it any different? I'm not really too sure. Okay. Anyways, though, I gotta be staying away from any police as well, even if it seems like they may want to help. Uh, oh, okay, lots of police there. Um, I'm not gonna worry about that. I can't get in the bank either. It actually, it's close, so it doesn't even matter. Okay, let's see. So that is not a police officer. But police officers over here ought to be taken care of. No, he's driving up to me, meaning I need to get out of here right now because he can just kick me out of my car because apparently police officers have magical powers in jailbreak. Okay, I need to get into a faster car. One with more, uh, one with more acceleration. I'm probably gonna go get the bike. I hear that the jewelry store was broken into somehow, even though there were three police officers outside of it. Why is it that whenever I want to break into somewhere, it can be like one police officer will just ruin my entire day, but then there's a situation where there's like a whole team of police officers outside the jewelry store and they just let it get broken into, unless it was like a no clipper or something. I don't know. I don't know, man. This feels way harder than it's that than, than it should be and I don't know maybe it's just me maybe I don't know well, I need a key card can't get one there and I can't even really go here because it's getting broken into even like look how how did they let it get broken into there's there's cops everywhere literally everywhere what am I supposed to do I don't know I need to kill these popo but then it's like even if I hypothetically cleared out all of the po and then I, and then tried breaking into the jewelry store myself or something. Knowing my luck, is something terrible would happen. A no clipper would come into the jewelry store before me, or I don't know, one police officer would just click me once and it would all be over. Okay, you know what? In the meantime, while we wait for the, the jewelry store to be refreshed and whatnot, we're gonna go to the other places, you know, bring up our bounty a little bit. Because remember, we don't need to worry about the amount that we steal. It's just the fact that we do the heist in the first place. Let's say, for example, the bank heist. You get 500 bounty for just, uh, even if you steal, like, $3. You know what I'm saying? And then it's like, uh, I don't know if it's exactly the same with the jewelry store. Because we tried that, and then it didn't give us any bounty. Which was very frustrating, because it's like, uh, I mean, come on. I sort of kind of deserved that and the game just like didn't give it to us so it was like okay well fine i'll just have to try even harder hold e come on please actually have money as well i'm sick and tired of coming here and there's nothing please yes okay 250 bounty not bad not bad not bad not bad 
Okay. Uh, I don't want to cross the water. Okay, we're gonna come this way. We'll go to the garage, and then uh, jewelry store probably still won't be ready by then. Could try to get a key card. I don't know if you can steal key cards from prisoners. I honestly just have no idea. You guys can let me know in the comments. That's what you could do. But in the meantime, I guess we're just gonna have to rely the old-fashioned classic way. Get stupidly lucky. Just hope that the police that find you don't have a single don't have a single brain cell, and then it's and then it's fine. Then you can do whatever. But if they actually know how it would know how to use the tools that are given to them, then it's literally impossible to do anything. Here we go, please. Yes. Okay, 500 bounty. Good start. Good start. I don't know what the top bounty is right now on the server. Our record... Was our record like 2300 or something like that? I don't even remember what ours was. I think we almost got to 3000. I think we were supposed to get to 3000, but then it didn't count one of our heists. But I might be wrong. I don't know. For, for those of you who remember that episode, it was one... It, 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 was, it was a recent jailbreak one. Oh, great. So now this place is getting broken into. Okay, well, I don't actually have the key card to get in there. The police officer there, he says he's a fan and whatnot, but you know what? It's just hard to... It's hard to just be a prisoner and then just be hanging out with prisoners. I hope you guys, uh... I hope you guys know where I'm coming from when I say that, you know? Um, okay, like, look, so here's something that is actually a little bit frustrating, though. Is like, say, this police officer who's following me right now, he obviously would hear the alarm going on in the bank right now there is another heist happening where a prisoner is trying to steal is that a is that a oh that's actually a criminal there sweet um but yeah and, and then and he started chasing me you know it's like it just it's it's very difficult to play jailbreak whenever you're also specifically getting targeted because it's like you almost can't even do anything now because all the police are focused on you and then all the other criminals are off constantly robbing these places and so they're easily getting the top bounty i need to wait all the time for the bank and the jewelry store to reset maybe i want to see how well we can do if uh if we try playing on an alt account let me know your thoughts in the comments below because I feel like it could significantly change the way things play out. Alright, I'm gonna wait, uh... I'm gonna do our little alleyway secret here. Oh, there's actually a police officer right there. What is she doing there? Hello? Hey, stop that. How about you stop that, huh? That's right, that's what I thought. Did she drop a key card, please? No, nope, she dropped a pistol. So I'm just waiting for that sign there to no longer just say... To just say closed. Okay. In the meantime, I think we can. Uh, I can't tell if that's uh, if that's a police officer outside the building there. Let's have a little peek. Let's do this. There doesn't really seem to be police officers anywhere, which is good. Yeah. Um. Why is this guy naked? Oh, police officer over there. Oh! Need to make sure we get that that copper over there that comes around the corner. Um, hello? Oh, right there. Oh my goodness. Okay. Uh, what do we do in this situation? Also, are those new cars? Is that a new car? There are new cars added to jailbreak. Cause I'm not too sure. Uh, hold on. Is that a police officer? I think it is. Okay, no, no, no. He's coming this way. Oh, no, that's bad. That's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. No. But I can even hear... I can hear all of them going in there. No, it just closed. Do you see what I mean? There were three police officers running towards me. I was super far away from the jewelry store. So it's like, I have no choice but to go in the opposite direction. Then some other prisoner just went up behind them and went into the jewelry store. What am I supposed to do? There, there's nothing I can do. I really need to make an alt account it went to, just to play jailbreak. I won't have any of the vehicles then. Oh, oh, what a disaster. <laughs> it, 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 it's exactly what I said. It's just like the jewelry store and bank are constantly not available for me because it's just, it's just constant bombarding. I, I can't do anything. I don't know. I can try to get a key card. That's like probably my next best bet here. I don't know if I can... Uh, if I can take out the Poe, 
There's that one there. But thing is, whenever they're in their cars, there's literally nothing you can do to them. But whenever the prisoner's in a car, oh, the police will they'll just kick them out of the car just like that. Easy. Right? Balanced? Wrong. Very not balanced at all. Okay, you see, because look, not like what? I, I can't do anything to the police officer when he's in his car, so he can just drive up to me, and then, and then what? I just, I just have to take it. I just gotta hope that the 3,000 shots it takes to kill a police officer will all hit before he manages to walk up to me and just clicks me with his, with his cuffs. Huh? Hmm? How about that? I don't know, he's, he's saying need help, but you know, you can never, you can never trust the coppers. You just can't. Did the, like, did the prisoner already escape? The, the criminal that robbed the jewelry store? I guess so. I just need- I, they, I can't do anything if they're in the cars. I need them to get out of the cars so I can kill them. Okay, they're both in the Lambo. I can follow up behind? Oh, okay, I don't know what this guy's trying to do. Um, I might have to just chase down the police. Uh, so why are they getting out there? Now there's this police officer chasing. There's two of them chasing me. Okay, so now while they're getting that, so you know now they're just coming back. You, but like, look, like the entire server's the police force is pretty much just on me right now. They're just following me, <laughs> no matter where I go. I'm not even like, I'm not even equipped to rob the bank and the jewelry store is closed right now and I'm still just getting followed by a group of police officers. You know what I mean? It makes the game, uh, you know, pretty difficult. Whenever, whenever you constantly just have police officers that can't just, you know, let you play the game. I mean, I get it that it's their job to, like, you know, arrest me and stuff because I'm a criminal, but it's like, whenever there's five of them, it's like, one versus one, a police officer versus a prisoner one-on-one -on -one is already extremely unfair and overpowered. Now imagine, like, five police officers constantly chasing one prisoner. You're not getting out of it. It's impossible. There's nothing you can do besides, like, just aimlessly drive through the alleyways like this and just pray that maybe, just maybe, the jewelry store will be open whenever you turn the corner and have just barely enough time to make it in. <sighs> or if you had a key card, that would work too. Or just find a police officer that's not in a car so I can actually do something about them. So, like, there's this guy here. Uh, oh boy, now that dude's in his motorbike. I just don't know what to do, guys. I'm constantly getting followed. Come on, there we go, please. Thank you. Anything, any key card? Nope, just a gun. Just my luck, it's just a gun, no key card. No key card, so uh, I'm just gonna wait for the jewelry store in that case. Okay, I don't know what's going on over there. I think they're taking care of some business, that's good stuff. What is this car? What is this? Kind of looks like a Porsche, maybe? I, I don't... I just, I, just I, I didn't even know they added new cars. I have no idea. I am, I am very ready for this jewelry store to be open. Now watch, it's gonna open as soon as I arrive back there, but some other prisoner is gonna be going inside of it. Happens every time. <laughs> Literally every time. It's 8.15, I don't even know if it's gonna be open now. Come on, please. Why is it so hard for me to get into one of these buildings? I obviously can't go in here. I don't know, I guess it's nighttime, just kind of, just pooped and just doomed. Can't do it, can't get inside. So I'm hesitant to leave, right? Cause like, I feel like it's just gonna open as soon as I leave. Say if I wanna go to the, uh, the gas station, you know, rob that. For all I know, while I'm doing that, I just missed out on a, a, a jewelry store heist. Also, okay, well, that could have been bad. <laughs> Here we go. We're almost there, so as long as we're not getting followed, which surprisingly we're not. Okay. Here we are. Just like a quick little rob. Listen for the vehicles. Any second now. And three, two, one, boop. Nope, no money. Okay, well that's just great. And now the police officer was right there. I'm not too sure what he was trying to do. If he really wanted to, he could have just kicked me out of the vehicle because police officers can do that. So I don't know why he didn't. Unless he just doesn't know how to be a police officer. Uh, let's try the donut store now, unless that's too obvious. Does the police officer know I'm going to be heading straight for the donut store? Perhaps not. 
Okay, here we go. Come on. Can we can we get over this? This is another thing. This is just another like very unnecessary thing for them to put in jailbreak is making it extremely difficult to get out of the river. Like why not allow us to just nicely drive up back onto land? You know, it's just another unnecessary un unnecessary poorly done game design. That's all I'm saying. Please, 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 I could really use a break. Is that a police officer? That's a police officer. I'm doomed. 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 No, dude. Okay, stop. If okay, guys, if you recognize me in a game, don't like don't don't try to like help me and give me items and stuff. Like I appreciate it whenever like especially if like I don't know the police officer just turns around. It's like you know what? Sure, just have the key card. It's you know a little head start. It's whatever, that's fine, but like, to be constantly following me and saying like, I'm gonna help you, I'm gonna help you, I'm gonna like, try to make the game easier for you. Just don't, because like, the whole point is like, I wanna play these games and show you th these games the way they're meant to be played. I don't wanna be showing you some weird version where I'm getting helped by the police, but I'm also a prisoner, so it's like there aren't really any like, bad guys, and it's weird. It's just weird. It's not how the game's meant to be played. So, like, I don't know. It's just as bad as, like, when I'm playing Murder Mystery, and then, I, like, I'm the sheriff, and the murderer, would, like, just walks up to me and says, like, kill me, I'm the murderer. I'm helping. You're not helping. You're just, uh, making the game, I don't know, it's honestly, just kind of ruining the game. Because it's just not, it's not how it's meant to be played. But, uh, anyways, both establishments still closed, even after our big journey there. So I that's it. I've tried so hard this episode and we we landed at 850 bounty Feels like I haven't been caught in ages But we just can't seem <laughs> To get into a single building. We can't complete one heist not even a matter of like doing it and then failing it Like we just can't even start it like what look this guy just keeps following me and it's just like that Wonder if I can kill them from all the way over here it's the tiniest little pixel I'm shooting at right now. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Finally, by the way. Wow. And then key card, key card, key card, key card, key card. That is mine. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Man, the snowman glitch just looks ridiculous. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, that's the police. No, thank you. Don't want anything to do with that. Bank, I'm assuming, is closed right now. Now that it's nighttime, I finally get the key card and I can't even get in. Oh, oh no. Oh, bad, bad. Oh no. Oh, I'm stuck. Ah! Um, okay. Well, they're just sitting outside the bank. Not much I can do about that. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, that's one down. We're now at 950 bounty, which is pretty cool. But we won't, we can't let these guys get to us. Okay, so now this dude's running at us. So we can maybe get, okay, I gotta reload. Great, great. Uh, having eight bullets in the pistol <laughs> makes it very, very, uh, very difficult. Very frustrating. Here, where are they coming from? They come there? Is that a... Okay, no, that's a criminal behind us. Good stuff. Uh, oh, no, he's just running towards us. <laughs> okay, here we go. Look, another prisoner literally standing right beside that police officer, and his first instinct was to run towards me as I was speeding away. Great. Great. Awesome. Uh, I definitely thought I killed him right there, but I'm still 950 bounty. Unless the other guy got him. Okay, he just dropped a pistol anyways. Okay, maybe we can get into the bank now? Maybe? Um, no. Who's that dude? Hey. Hey. Huh. How about... No! Eh. Oh, no. Ooh, lots of po, lots of po. Okay. Reloading that. I gotta reload this here pistol. 
Now let's see, where are these guys at? So that other police officer is hiding in there now. Oh, okay. Forcing me into close combat, which is would be um, very dumb of me to fall for because whenever you're in close combat with a police officer, they can just essentially one-tap you. Uh, you got to rely on having some distance. But here now, by him being in that room... I mean, I don't know, he's essentially making himself invincible. Like, honestly, if you're a police officer, sit in this room. Sit in this room, there's nothing they can do, because you can just arrest them instantly, or you can just tase them. There's there's no challenge to it. There's no, like, I don't know. There's no strategy. But, yeah, I mean, that is just straight up called camping, by the way. So, uh, you would just be camping the building, and that's no fun. Okay, uh, there's way too many police officers. Like, just outside the bank right now, there's like six police officers. There's no way I'm getting in. I don't even know how there could... <sighs> it was literally just broken into you. Literally just broken into? Why does this keep happening? <laughs> Come on! I can't do it. I can't, I just can't do it. I, I don't know what it is. Me and jailbreak, it just doesn't work. It doesn't happen. I think next time I'm playing this, I'm going to play on an alt account. You guys gotta let me know in the comments. Should we play jailbreak on an alt account and then that way we can have actual normal gameplay and not be given some really weird, obscure version where we're constant we constantly have a group of police officers on us and then some of them are trying to help us and some of them aren't and it's like super weird and just confusing. So there's that, but on the flip side, we lose all of our vehicles by making an alt an, an alt account, so up to you guys, if you want to keep seeing the really weird, in my personal opinion, very unfair, unbalanced version, I'll just keep doing this, but otherwise, um, we may have to go incognito, but ladies and gentlemen, on that note, I would like to thank you so much for joining me for another episode of Roblox Adventures. If you enjoyed, please do remember to leave the video a like, maybe even subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, but other than that, I will see you guys in the next one.